90% of all organisms that ever lived on Earth are extinct. The Community Conservation Fund Africa is a registered non-profit organization set up to help put the spotlight on these rural communities that live among the wild animals. 70% of all wildlife in Africa live outside of dedicated protected areas, sharing the land with rural communities who by large have received little benefit from this often difficult privilege. Animals are dying. And then if I become a guide, what I'm gonna to show tourists, there'll be nothing. How do you change someone's mind? How do you convince impoverished communities that preservation will benefit them more than poaching? It is our view that we need collaborative engagement with communities, or else wildlife and wild areas will continue to disappear at an alarming pace. I mean, we've got something here that nobody else has got in the world. So, you know, if we don't protect it, one of our major assets for tourism, or the major asset in my opinion, is gone. I think education is, uh, is absolutely key, and that's where I think Mantis uh, and Accor Hotels can, uh, can support the efforts. Uh, on an ongoing basis to raise awareness through the channels we have, through the guests that we have, um, and to help the team on the grounds uh, save the right. CCFA aims to further its reach and become the biggest non-profit in tourism, working from within the industry, supporting communities to conserve wild animals and their habitats. The grant-giving organization has brought together three global conservation giants as its founding members. African Parks, Tusk Trust, and Wilderness Foundation Africa. We envision local African communities who are educated and empowered and are able to manage wild animals and wilderness areas in a sustainable way. We believe that this change will have a direct impact on the preservation of nature. Help us to be the voice of our local communities and our dying species. <laughs>